Hello guys and welcome to another Blender quick tip and as you can see I'm back in my compositor again so well we will do some compositing today and what I thought would, would be nice to learn is how to make the anamorphic flare you can add in magic bullet looks in after effects or just in the blank after effects um, as a glare I think it's just called glare so yeah let's get started uh, here I have a scene with my smoke and a text and yeah I already combined them with an alpha over note and then I'm gonna add a uh, where is it a glare note to our text yeah that's good uh, and then we need to modify our glare note a bit it's already set to streaks so that's good I'm gonna turn down the color modulation uh, all the way to zero this will um, the color modulation uses to um, split the red blue and green channels and modify them a bit so it has like a chromatic aberration or dispersion like it's called in blender also I will turn the mix up to one so we will see only the glare and yeah turn down the threshold to about 0.1 or whatever it looks good on your text M maybe I'm gonna turn it even up a bit more yeah and now if we turn down the streaks to two we have like those after effects streaks you can play around with the fade I like to set it all the way to 0.75 but in this case I'm gonna try 0.8 also you can turn up the iterations to make it a bit longer but this is rather small so I will add a burnout so we can blur out those streaks a bit more I will use fast caution since this is a lot faster and set the Y, no, leave the Y at about 0.1 just to soften it out a bit then the X we can use let's say 15 and this will blur out our streaks to the left and the right I'm gonna set it to 25% also I will add an RGB curves um, to add a bit more contrast to my streaks and give it a slightly bluish touch by increasing the blue channels a bit so yeah now you can just grab an add node color mix node I mean set it to add and add your streaks to your text put the text in there yeah and then you have your streaks and yeah, you can play around with the settings a bit to make it look better I'm gonna turn down the opacity by setting the mix factor of the color add node a bit down and yeah that's it so that's how you can make an anamorphic flare and blender really easy if you like this tutorial feel free to leave a like make sure to subscribe